What's happening everybody and welcome back to another episode of Rust. That's right, we're out here playing Rust. This is the PvE server and we're still continuing to grow. So, so far we have the tier 1 bench, we have the tier 2 bench, we have our cooker and we have a bit of storage and stuff like that. Not much going on upstairs, just a bit of a cooker and that's about it. So let's continue. So I need to get more scrap, mate. Need to get more scrap. I tell you what. Even though this is a PvE server, I'm still struggling to get, like, places, mate. I don't know how people get so far so quick. Like, do these people just grind that much? Do they really grind that much? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, because I just don't seem to find much scrap, man. I don't know what's going on, whether we just need to go somewhere else or... Or, you know, we need to search something different. But I just don't seem to find scrap like everybody else seems to. Like, you look at other people's places and they just seem to have scrap like it's easy, like it's nothing. Like they find it all over the place, mate. Don't get me wrong, I find it all over the place, but... It's just not the same. See, it's weird to see, like, people's cars and that just chilling out the front. <laughs> it's mad, though. It's mad. Low grade field. Just need to keep the eye as a, eyes peeled for those, um, scientists. If you watched last episode, we did manage to take down a scientist. And, um, yeah, so we're getting better, mate. We're getting better. We only just took him down, but we're getting better. So, 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 so. It's a pretty cool looking house. Almost looks like a factory of some sort, eh? Let's keep cruising. Let's keep cruising, mate. Let's just keep cruising. See what we got. Look at these cool houses, man, along here. Just brings a whole new dynamic, being that it's PvE, eh? Whole new dynamic. The people got some weird ways of building, I tell you that. What we got? Ooh, ooh. Not bad, not bad. So today's probably just going to be like a bit of a hunt, bit of a search. We do need to find scrap. Is the main thing we need to find, mate. A lot of scrap. Which we just don't seem to have at all. And we don't seem to be able to find any. Now, I'm pretty certain you can find scrap up in this place, can't you? It's not very good for finding scrap, I remember. But there is scrap in there, so we'll go have a look. We'll go have a look, mate. Put some effort in, you know? <laughs> Put some effort in, dude. Alright, let's see. No scientists. Not seeing nothing. So this game still is the number one survivor game out at the moment. But that's pretty crazy to think. Such an old game is still number one survival game. I don't know why it's number one survival game, but it is. Oh, look, we're starting to get a fair lot of diving equipment. We might be able to go diving soon. Check out all the new, um, what are we doing? <laughs> Just trying to open it. Check out all the new underwater stuff they added. I did hear that they re redone up underwater. It'd be interesting to go check it out, mate. Interesting to go check it out. Get ourselves a kayak, you know. Go for a row, mate. Nice and leisurely ro ro row along the water. Why not? Oh, we got some food. Nice. Nice. Anything at the front? No. Nah. But yeah, it's pretty crazy to think that this is the number one survival game out of all the ones that are out. There are a few decent ones that are, that have come out, but for some reason, yeah, this one still still beats them all. Beats them all, mate. If you know why this game is number one, write in the description down below. Give me your description of why you think this is the best survival game out. Best survivor game out, mate. Why? Give me your answers. Tell me your stories. Cause I'd love to know. I'd love to know. Like I do I do like the game, it is pretty cool. Um, but if it was me choosing one, I would say probably not the best survivor game out there, but you know, 
Steam charts don't lie, mate. Steam charts don't lie. So, clearly, I don't know what's a good game. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know what's a good game, but it seems alright. Like, it's it's fun. It is fun. I did find um, the, PvE, uh, the PvP element of it was okay, but it was kind of frustrating as well at the same time. So, I don't know whether it's that's what bring so many people back is that frustration you know you wanted to get to the top be number one whatever it is let's cook all that up ah yeah do another cooker see what kind of scrap we get today we need more of this stuff like the proper scrap that's what we need a lot more of it So that's the biggest thing that we're having troubles trying to find. At the moment anyway. At the moment. Let's eat this while we're waiting. Good thing is you don't have to worry about getting mugged while you're here. <laughs> you just sort of chill out. Take it all in, you know. Take in the environment, mate. Take in the environment. Nice. We'll probably be back on our way back. We'll just go check over here. See if there is anything. Isn't there a way you can get in here or something? No? Is it in here? Whee. What's this? What's this? Got a green key card. I have no idea what that's for. But we got one. Okay, so we didn't really get that much scrap. Not enough to return yet. Interesting. Very interesting. What we got? Nothing? Nothing, mate. Nothing. Now, I did do... I do remember something about you can use this. Maybe it's got to be turned on or something, but... Fuel storage. Can you put that in there? Mount. Wee, check this out. Wee. Alright. How do you drive then? I have no idea how you drive. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's just up and down. Okay, so you can turn it. Does it not move, maybe? That's pretty cool. But I have no idea how you use it. Oh look, someone's running around out there. Yeah, I'm not too sure. How do we get out? Can I get my fuel back? Ah. Oh. Get out, mate. Get out. Take your fuel. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know how you work that thing. Or like, what you're supposed to do. <laughs> But that's part of the reason why we're in PvE, so sort of learn this stuff, you know? And figure it out without the the worry of getting lit up by another player, you know, that already knows how to do it. It's part of our struggle, mate. Part of our struggle. That's the biggest problem that we're having on the main servers, is that, yeah, everybody else already knows how to do all this stuff. So they're running around doing it, and then, yeah, I'm just chilling. Ooh, Mr. Piggy. What up, Piggy? I not wanna, I not wanna go, buddy. Got a present for you. Got a present for you, piggy. More chocolate bars, mate. Some more chocolate bars. Can't complain about that. 
Hit me. What I haven't seen is um, the patrol helicopter. You know that patrol helicopter that usually flies around? I haven't seen one of them. I've seen like the plane dropping off stuff, but I haven't seen the patrol chopper, which is a bit weird. You'd think that would be a big PvE element thing, like, you know. Or is that controlled by PvP? Is that one of the things that, you know, where you gotta activate it or something in a PvP setting? I'm not sure, eh? Oh, it's that damn pig again. What do you want, piggy? I told you. Yeah. You want to be running. You want to be running. Turn you into bacon. I turn you into bacon! Sorry. Got a little carried away there. <laughs> These mad houses, though. Everyone's just living along the side of the road here. Our house is sort of up on the hill, chilled back a bit. I thought I'd do that just so it doesn't block like the spawns of like these, you know, so things can spawn out front and we can still collect it. That's the main reason I didn't build directly on the road. Filling up, we're filling up. Alright, well, might return home. Might as well return home, people. Bam. What we get? What we get, mate? What we get? 168. Ah. Oh. See what I mean? It's just a grind, bro. It's such a grind. I don't understand it. Like, even in a PvE situation, it's still a grind. Still a grind. So we did manage to sort out some of our stuff here. We got clothing. So we now have... Do we have a full suit? Maybe. Maybe that's a full suit. I think we've got a full diving suit, possibly. Um, oh, we've got another tank, just in case we run out. Yeah, so we might have a full diving suit. Possibility here. We've got our weapons. All in the, up in the one container. And we've got our food. Which I'll eat one of these. All in this container. Okay, so what do we got left? And then this is just the resource junk for recycling and things like that. I don't know what the green card's for, but we'll put it in there for now. If you know what the green card's for, write in the description down below, people. Write in the description down below. Alright, well, we are going to leave this one here. Hopefully you've all enjoyed that. Smash the like button. Consider hitting the subscribe. And as always, I'll catch you in the next episode. See you later.